What is going on, everybody? It is Nexus Complex, and we are back. We're going to continue our journey. We're going to try to just power through this story. I'm not going to read. I'm just going to be pressing the B button as much as I can. I don't care about the Galarian heroes. I just want to move on. The next gem. Come on. I want to get some captures and... Add some team members, you know, hopefully not get any more of my Pokemon murdered like I did the last couple episodes. You know, three for three, baby. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, piece of candy. Ah, oh, come on, bidet. I'm so tired of you, bro. That's cool. I didn't realize he had a great ball. Duosion. Alright, Cloud. Let's kill some stuff. Goodbye, Duosion. Oh, you've seen enough of me already? Yeah? Uh-huh. This guy. This fucking guy. Alright. It's gonna be the easiest battle ever. Just keep cooking Crunch with a Pokemon with a ridiculous attack. Oh, shit. Alright, so we're just gonna kill with this crunch and we're gonna get out of here. Kind of completely forgot that Hatterim is a fairy type. Probably wasn't the best idea to stay out with a dragon type. But we got through it. Sheer luck. But Ponyta? That's a no-go. So we're going to use the clamps. That did a lot more than I thought it would. That did a lot more than I thought it would. Okay, Red, we're going to have to cheat. Come on out here. Level 39. Need you to come just murder stuff. Alright. Oh, no. Confusion. Ugh. Come on, hit the Shadow Sneak. Yeah. Get out of here, Ponyta. Looking like a toothpaste unicorn and shit. Dude, you don't have to do shit for the chairman. He does not care about you, dude. Come on, Red, hit the Shadow Sneak. Yeah! It lived. I'm impressed. Keep hurting ourselves in confusion! It's been like a four turn confusion. This is insane. Come on, break it. There we go. Is 
the clamp's gonna evolve soon? Ooh, what's better, knockoff or night slash? In a game, I, in a game playthrough, I guess night slash. Knockoff is better in competitive, but we'll go with night slash here. And big perp back on the team, learning some new moves. Nah, I don't want to give you a do-over. Oh, shit! Trapinch is evolving! Diomedes, you beautiful boy! You're gonna become a Vibrava! Yes! Look at that sick-looking Vibrava! Oh my gosh, Diomedes, you look amazing! Vibrava! The Vibration Pokémon! The ultrasonic waves it generates by rubbing its two wings together cause severe headaches! God, that shiny Vibrava looks so sick, though. Dragon Breath. Absolutely you can. Actually, nah. You're better as a physical attacker, my guy. But I appreciate you trying to learn things. Oh, bidet. day. You were totally set up. Oh, Rose. So I'm wondering, like, in the Twilight Wing series that I was talking about, so far they've depicted Rose as, like, a pretty stand-up guy. Seems like a decent dude. Um, I'm wondering if they're going to show his, like, dark side at some point in Twilight Wings. Also, because of Twilight Wings, I've realized that I've been pronouncing her name completely wrong the whole time. It's Oleana. Not Olena. It's Oleana. And now Bidet gets thrown into Poker Prison. All right. I like how the mural was like fine, the wall's not really destroyed, and then all of a sudden it just cuts to like the wall being just destroyed. <sighs> Zakian and Zamazenta are pretty cool legendaries. I think Zakian's design is way cooler than Zamazenta's. But gosh, that Zakian's ability is just so broken. So broken. Alright. See, do I got anything to teach Vibrava? Do I have a physical dragon move? Dragon Claw, but he cannot learn it. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Alright, that's all fine. Do 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 do. Let's probably get back on my shitty bike and ride out of here. Deuces. Deuces all your bullshit. I'm gonna go fight a fairy type gym with my team of dragons. <laughs> uh, here we go. So we get an encounter. So we can get a new Pokemon. Full heals. It actually could come in handy at some point. Oh no, a chef! Alright, here's our encounter. Ooh, it's Morgrim. I really, really enjoy. The Grim Snarl line. We're definitely not going to take on more Grim. 
with our three dra- Jesus, I forgot that I really did have three dragons. It's insane. Should maybe switch the team around a little bit. Alright, so I can't use the same move. But I can use a potion, and I will. So I don't lose Rid here because I didn't heal up. Torment again? Oh no! Um, I guess it's Aerial Ace. I don't think Morgan will die from it, and then we can try to capture it. Switch it out for another Pokemon. Let's see if we can catch it here in the uh, yellow. With a great ball. There we go. Alright, cool. So we're going to switch out one of the dragon types for the egg. I guess. Um, who do we switch out here? Ghost Cowboy makes the most sense because we already have both of his types on the team. So we'll keep Ghost Cowboy in the reserves for now. I'm sure the way I've been playing this game, he will have his chance to sign at some point. Because I've been getting, I've been getting Pokemon killed left and right. It has been insane. So this is the egg that we will use instead. So let's see what it is. Hopefully it's something good. Preferably, as much as I... It, it's weird to say this. Hopefully not another dragon type. We have enough dragon types right now. It's a Feebass. That's cool. Melodic is awesome. But I I forget how to get it now. But let's see. Feebass, the fish Pokemon. Although unattractive and unpopular, this Pokemon's marvelous vitality has made it a subject of research. Damn, Feebass. They just straight up merch you <laughs> in the description. <laughs> Although unattractive and unpopular, it still somehow lives its life. No one knows why. So let's see here. I almost want to name it like one of the Kardashians' nicknames. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we're going to name it Kendall. <laughs> they, I don't know. I don't know their lives. It's just funny to me. So, uh, I think we'll keep Kendall in on the team right now. Get some levels. I'll have to research how to evolve Melotic in this because all I've done is capture Melotic. Uh, I caught it in the fog. Look at that sick ass hop. Ugh. We got a double battle. Should I get the team ready for the double battle? Cloud does not have any reason to be in the double battle. Neither does Kindle, neither is Big Perp. So let's heal the clamps. Yeah, we'll heal Cloud too. Alright, so Diomedes in the clamps. Going to this double battle. Hopefully they can pick up the win. The railways are amazing! They carry lots of people and Pokemon at once. Yeah, man, that's what Train does. You also came to ride the Galar Train. Wow! Who would have thunk it? Daring couple, Robert and Jacqueline. What makes them so daring? Ooh, Ninetales and Kirlia. Alright. Okay, so... Alright, Dio. 
pretty good damage to Ninetales. Ninetales using Incinerate. Ooh, that hit the clamps fairly hard. Psybeam to the clamps. Whew. Alright, so. Ninetales is the fastest of the Pokemon. Use a super potion on the clamps. And then we gotta try to take down. Oh. Alright, we can take down the nine tails. Hopefully, uh, the Curlia doesn't use a fairy type move on Dio. And hopefully, they don't double into the clamps again, because he will die. Shit. Alright. Oh, that crit sucks. Right, so we get rid of the nine tails. Oh, the Kirlia. Hopefully it uses side beam on Verbrava. If not, we're gonna lose the clamps. Oh shit. Okay. So, ironically, that was the best case scenario. So now we're just going to hit this thing twice and hopefully kill it. Whew. So close in that battle. Oh my god, I thought the clamps was a goner. I was about to be pretty upset. I don't care about your damn train. I don't care about your relationship. Get out of my way. I gotta go heal my Pokemon now. Cause you guys are assholes. Alright, so here's Balan Leia. So we're gonna have to reconfigure this team for a fairy type gym because dragons aren't good against fairies, if you guys didn't know. So, let's see here. Sven will be pretty good. Switch out for Diomedes. And that's basically... it's basically it. Sansa is okay. We have a Dawnstone. So I think we just maybe go in with a few Pokemon? Yo, let's keep Kinder on the team. So basically, we're going to hope that Sven and Red can do this. Let's see. How much does one large candy give in XP? Alright, so I can give him one more large candy and he'll be fine. Oh, wow, I forgot. He evolves level 28. Cool, so we get an evolution. We're gonna have a Perserker going into the gym battle. Ooh, that looks pretty sick. Sven. Full Viking doubt here. Perserker, the Viking Pokemon. What appears to be an iron helmet is actually hardened hair. This Pokemon lives through the thrill of battle. Yeah, he totally looks like he just got done pillaging. A village. Killing the villagers. And he wants to learn Iron Head? That's amazing. Fairies don't like Iron Head. It hurts them a lot. Sven, you're gonna be great, buddy. You're gonna do good things on this team, Sven. Alright, we'll give him one more large EXP candy. He's level 32. So you know what? We'll give him one more. One more. 
There we go, level 35 seems good. So him and red. Big, big purple one real quick. Now we'll keep what we got right now. Alright, big purple's now level 34. Bounce. Hmm. Yeah, let's do that. Let's teach you bounce. Let's have my big whale just mashing people up. Alright, cool. So now... Sven, you're going to be the main one we're using here. So here we go. So we got Sven... We got Age of Slash. We're still we're gonna go try to take down this gym real quick. And then we'll probably call it an episode. Like I guess I'm trying to like power through this now with the DLC being out. And I just wanna I wanna try to complete this. Oh, it's Marnie! Everyone's favorite challenger. Alright. Come on, Marnie. Just let me go in here and battle this gym. I don't have time for story. Oh, that's cool. I didn't notice they have the uh, seating charts on the wall. That's awesome. Hey, ball guy, what you got for me? Love ball. Oh, that's probably like one of the worst balls. All right, so here we go. Gonna go in here and do this challenge. Oh, that's right. They just ask us questions. I'm hoping Sven will just like body these fairies uh, since he's steel type. Don't tell me to break a leg. I know what you actually mean. Yeah, you don't mean do good. You mean actually break a leg. Bastard. Set me up for failure here. Fairy type gym trying to act all nice and oh yeah, look at this. Oh, we're so cute. We're so nice. Yeah, no, no you're trying to try to actually beat me with those pipes and everything. <sighs> Alright, so it's an audition. I don't want to be the fairy type gym leader, but if I had to, I'd do it. Fairy type is pretty OP. And now they've added my boy Azumarill back to the game, who is my favorite of the fairy type Pokemon. Gardevoir being a close second. Oh, which reminds me, so in my league, right? One of the teams is the Majestic Gardevoirs. And uh, for my videos, if the teams don't have a logo, I've been trying to make a logo because it looks just better when I'm making the videos. Uh, I googled Gardevoir. Oh my gosh. Like, probably one of the worst moves you could ever make. There's so much Rule 34 stuff with Gardevoir, and it's, it's just disgusting. I just don't understand it. Here comes Slurpuff. Oh, question. 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 They're both... They're both the weaknesses. Oh, no. You gave me an attack boost. I don't really need it. Get out of here, Slurpuff. Sven doesn't give a damn. Looks like Sven's gonna come in clutch in this gym. Kendall, get to level 14. I didn't realize Annette looks like she's kind of old, too. Didn't you just leave? They should have given it at least like another character model. It's literally like the same character almost. In fact, it is the same exact character. Swirlix. Well, if I learned one thing from the first battle, is that you guys don't like steel. So I'm going to hit you with my iron head. Goodbye. Aromatis. Question, question. Previous trainer's name. Annette. Give me that boost, son. 
No, oh no, a speed boost? What are you doing to yourselves? Goodbye, Aromatis. Yeah, we're just gonna plow through this gym, man. Kendall wants to live tackle. All right, Teresa, get out of here. They really should have used at least a, a one more trainer type model during this gym instead of just the same person four times over. This is just ridiculous. More Grim. Oh no, I used Covet. No. That was actually a really smart move on their part. Curry. Oh no. Shake the confusion, Sven. You can do it. Yeah. Get out of here, Morgrim. Garnivore! Dazzling Gleam is not going to do much. Wow, that did way more than I expected. Oh, it was a crit. Okay. Let's eat that berry up. Let's not be confused anymore, and let's just crush it with this iron head. Break the confusion. Yes. Alright, so that is a dead Garnivore. Very cool. That crit hit me so hard. I'd have been so worried had I not broke the confusion that turn. <sighs> You're a strong method actor, so you've played the last three characters yourself. Alright, so now we're going to heal Sven up real quick. And then we're going to go beat up Opal. We're going to go beat up an old woman. Take her money. Yes. Let's challenge the gym leader. Gonna need a montage. Beaten gym montage. I guess she doesn't walk out there. She's already waiting. She walks so slow. They're like, nah, we're not doing that. Ah, I don't care, Opal. I don't care at all. Yeah, look. Could you imagine? Had they just had her walk out at the pace she walks? It would have been the whole video right there, just her walking out to the field. Weezing. Galarian Weezing. Really awesome ability. Neutralizing gas is really cool. Right, so four Pokemon, so we're going to curse real quick. Going to get some attack boosts, some defense boosts. Question, question. Do you know my nickname? The Magic User. So let's hit it with Iron Head. All right. Iron Head takes Weezing down. And now, since there's three Pokemon left, we're going to Dynamax our Berserker here. Actually, you know what? We might wait. 
Yeah, we're gonna try to set up on this Mawile a little bit. We're gonna use a curse on Mawile. So Mawile really can't do much to me, I don't think. So now's a good time to uh, get the boost that we need, especially because it used Intimidate. So now we're plus two attack, plus three defense. Question! What's your favorite color? Pink! I don't care about your questions, lady. Ironhead this thing, I'm done. Done with these stupid questions. Alright, who's next? Who's next to go down? Togekiss. Oh, Togekiss, you jerk. We could add a Togekiss, but I had to mess it all up. That's right. It was me, Dio! Air Slash. Alright. Done with this, Max Steel Spike. Alright, Zvan, hopefully I gave you Dynamax candies. If not, I'm gonna feel really stupid. I did give you Dynamax candies. Fantastic. Don't flinch. Perfect. Oh, that's right, I forgot. Dynamax can't flinch. And that's a dead token kiss. So she's got Hatterene. That's her Gigantamax, right? Alright, I'm wondering... I think we still... Oh, it's Alcremie. Okay. I think we... Do we outspeed Alcremie? I don't know. But we should kill Alcremie. We should kill our cream with this max steel spike, I'm hoping. What is Gigantamax? We might lose Sven. We might lose Sven here. Because I'm just kind of like... Playing fast and loose. Not really thinking about what I'm doing before I do it. Which is always a key to success. G-Max finale. We should live this, right? Oh, shit. We don't. Okay. Fantastic. Um... <laughs> so there goes Sven. One episode of kicking ass, and he's dead. Cool. Um... Who can do anything? I guess Red. I guess Red, it's up to you, buddy. Well, that was super disappointing that Sven died so quickly. Holy shit. Let's boost my Pokemon. Alright. Now, hopefully, that boost will kill this. How oh, creamy. Booyah! Thank you, Opal, for helping me beat you and a crit. All right, perfect. All right, so we lose another Pokemon, so I'm four for four. So if I keep it up, baby, we're just going to have a Pokemon die every game until I either lose or win. So here we go. So the Rid comes up clutch, beats the G-Max out creamy, and we've defeated Opal for our fifth gym badge.
Yeah, I didn't want to be the fairy gym leader anyways. Fifth badge, baby. We're working our way up. There's Draining Kiss, which would have been nice to have for a Toga Kiss. <laughs> but it's dead. Alright, so Opal has been defeated. So, there we go. That's the episode, everybody. Oh, did I just engage in story? That's right, she'll take me right back to Hammerlock. Cool. And then I think she creepily identifies Bidet as her uh, protege. Alright, so that is it. We're gonna... Oh yeah, we gotta put Sven in the box. God damn it. Alright. So there goes super cool Sven into the box. We now have six feints throughout this Nuzlocke. We'll put Dio back on the team. And Cloud back on the team. So we need to get some more captures to round this team out. But that is it, everybody. As always, thank you for joining me. I will catch you guys on the next one. This is Nexus Complex, out.